You guys, the, uh, the movie was fantastic. I thought it was awesome. Thank and you, you both did such a great job in it. It was really funny, but touching and endearing at the same time, which is tough to pull off. Uh -huh. So it was fantastic. Now, Alyssa, your character, Emily, in this is a 16-year-old uh, overachiever, basically. Yeah. And um, you're 27 now? Happy birthday to me. Shh. I'm old enough to know not to answer that question. <laughs> related, by the way. Me I've too. taught her uh, well. <laughs> can you tell us a little bit about your character, and was it difficult to get yourself in the mind frame of someone with, like 10 years younger than you? Um, not necessarily. I was 24 when we shot it. Okay. Yeah. Right? Oh, my gosh. So it, kidding? The, and that, even though it's only, what, three years, mm. is a huge difference. Sure. Me at 24 to me at 27. Sure. <laughs> I don't even know that person anymore. <laughs> um, so it wasn't that difficult. Uh -huh. I did listen to a lot of Taylor Swift, and I write every day. So mm. I read through my journals from when I was 15, 16, 17, 18, oh, cool. and kind of compiled that. And honestly, Emily's a very mature girl. She knows what she wants. She's mm -hmm. going to college. This is what she's doing. And that level of maturity belongs to, I think, all of us in mm -hmm. our adulthood. Sure. So basically taking all of my ADD and type anus and putting it into a 16-year-old, <laughs> I was like, oh, okay. So instead of thinking about, like, career, da 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 just, just jump roping. Yeah. So that was fun. And it was fun to be innocent again sure. and to have that mm -hmm. vigor and that energy that you have as a 16-year-old. Yeah. Difficult in a way, but I think all of your characters are difficult. Absolutely. Otherwise, you don't choose to do them. Now, Kristen, you're great in this as well. Um, your portrayal of Samantha made me cringe. It was like she just couldn't put down that damn cell phone for a second. <laughs> no. And so, what was your inspiration for Samantha? And could you also tell us a little bit about uh, that character? Yeah, I just have to say, though, I, I was really so impressed with all the kids in the movie, but mm. recently I was asked what my favorite part of the movie is. And it's not just because she's here, but. I really think that this girl is going to have a, she's had a wonderful past, mm -hmm. but I think the glass is half full. She's got a lot more to go, and I was so impressed with her. And I was just proud, because I, I too, am a type A personality, and which is what I tapped into. Is, sure. But um, I'm pr hopefully not, you know, that type A and, <laughs> you know, ignoring my own children for my career. Sure. But I, 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 I've seen a lot of women at Central Park have meltdowns with their kids sure. that, are, <laughs> that are clearly on the break from the office. Yeah, yeah. And they've just, they've had it. Uh -huh. So I, I just spent a lot of time at Central Park yeah. <laughs> watching moms and, and kids. And um, what I loved, obviously, too, as you can imagine, is just seeing the change for the, for the entire family. Sure. Um, and just my relationship with Modine, you know, having a good time. We, we bonded a lot because we were sitting in those chairs with tape on and ropes. Which again, I never need to be any bound in any way. Again, no, I'm done. Enough of I it, did right? that, yeah. and now it's done. <laughs> but but I had a good time. Yeah. It was a fun part. Now, um, a lot of the the jump roping scenes are in, are in slow motion, but there's a, you know a number of times where you actually see how fast you're going. Mm -hmm. Did you train for that? Was that like a stunt double? Was that you actually doing that? It was both. I trained for four months uh -huh. with a private trainer in LA, uh -huh. and that got me this like really lean, strong Pilates physique. And I got to Michigan, and they're like, yeah, that's great, but and then I started training with the Olympic team. Um, who were in Michigan. Which I didn't so even strange. know oh, cool. that. Um, yeah. And those huh. girls and boys, I was like, they are built and they're going so fast. So I trained with them the duration of our filming as well on my mm -hmm. days off. And after they, my day ended at seven, I would train with them until nine. Um, and so the slow motion's all me. Mm -hmm. And a couple of the fast ones are them because they go every second, their, hits, hip, their right foot hits the floor like twice. It's yeah, insane. it's crazy. There's no way I could learn how can to do that. Can you imagine? Yeah. I got to like 37. And when they're saying in like like two <laughs> per second, it's just it's, insane. It's yeah. insane. I it's walk wild. up the stairs and I'm like, oh my. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I take like one step every two minutes. Yeah, exactly. So, you know, <laughs> yeah. They, they say in the film, uh, Emily says in the film that um, passions help move us in life. Um, what are some passions besides acting that uh, drive you guys in life? I love um, Wild Aid and the World Wildlife Fund. I am currently working with Wild Aid to do um, their shark campaign, sh banning shark fin soup and shark finning in general. It's really important to oh, me. Yeah. So, yay, no cool. more shark fin yes, soup. Please. Um, uh, and then my family. Uh -huh. I think the last two years have really taught me how important my family is and that my friends included in that. Um, without them, it would be nothing. So. Family and sharks. <laughs> I'm so proud of her. I know. I just watch her and I just love this person. Um, for me, I have a charity, Maddie's Corner. Um, uh -huh. I have a dog, Madeline Conchenoweth, and um, we basically just try to help 
animals be adopted, especially like when Katrina happened or a natural disaster or the recent hurricane here in New York, animals become displaced or lost or given up or just abandoned. So we place um, dogs and cats in hopefully good homes oh, and help with, you know, get them spayed and neutered and all that. So maddiescorner.com, people can check it out. Please, thank you so much. Thank I you, appreciate honey. it. Thanks.